Hello everybody and welcome to the OMEA Allstate Symphonic Band Audition Tenor Saxophone Version. My name is Edith Chenere and I teach saxophone at the U of O School of Music and Dance. Um, the audition is pretty straightforward. We have exercise one, exercise two, and exercise three. Let's hear them. <laughs> the chromatic scale, be sure to use A sharp fingering to B rather than bis to B. Don't use bis B flat to B. This is called rolling and it's just a terrible idea all around. Don't do it. Right? After we get from B to C, I would like you to use B, C, and C sharp. It is true that we can do B, side C, C sharp, but that option, especially on tenor, side C is a really flat note, and that movement of B, side, release is often really inaccurate, and it makes the time feel kind of funny. You're much better off with going B, C, flipping the fingers, and living up to C sharp. <laughs> For the, uh, for the exercise number two, listen very carefully when I'm playing vibrato and when I'm playing straight tone. When you play vibrato, you want to be bold with your chin motion. The, al the alto saxophone has a much smaller reed than the tenor saxophone. So on alto, I could get away with a small chin movement and it would still sound like beautiful vibrato. But for me to sound vibrato that would make sense on tenor, I need to make my chin movement much bigger. Think about the hand motion of vibrato on violin versus the hand motion of vibrato on cello. It's bigger and wider and slower. Same thing. For tenor saxophone, our vibrato needs to be bolder. So have courage and make sure that you can play with vibrato that is so awesome that we can hear. Technical etude, pretty straightforward. Start slow. Put the metronome even on the eighth note pulse, even start at 50% speed and work your way up very gradually. Play at 50% and 60%. So many times that you know exactly what's going on and there are no surprises. You're not surprised by that, for example, that uh, G sharp three measures before the end. No surprises. Only when there are absolutely no surprises, then bump the tempo up very slow. Thank you for checking out this video. Thank you for listening today. Thank you for playing music. If you have any questions, if you'd like to follow up or anything that you heard that you would like to ask about, email me at ishner, I-S-H-N-E-R, at uoregon.edu. Thanks, and I'll see you soon.